Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Jamstar Overwatch Weekly game. Uh, sorry, day one. My name is Demand, and a very warm welcome to you on this glorious Thursday night in uh, the first week of Overwatch. It is very much excitement time. I feel like a fat kid in the candy store with uh, Daddy's American Express. And joining me tonight uh, for a fair bit of the the evening is none other than uh, Bobby J. Bobby, welcome. Thank you, Demand. And uh, we're here with a third round here tonight in the winner's bracket. We've got Paragon Esports on the blue side with Bo Ray, Joey G, Miracle, Tesca, Michello, and BZRK, or uh, Berserk, I guess that would be how you should say it. And then on the red side, we've got Jam Gaming, who just won on King's Row. We've got Jim, I was just going to say Jim, Bokyan, Atar, Dozer, Peels, Fresh. Um, and yeah, let's, let's get into it. So... What do you think about this map, Demand? So we're on uh, Lijiang Tower, so it's going to be a single point uh, rather than a payload map. Uh, so yeah, single point, and we're going to see who controls it. That's how we're going to roll it out. So in terms of the lineups, uh, who's going to get in on the site first? So it's going to be Jim. He's going to be up in front and large and in charge. He's uh, got a couple of shields going to uh, exchange some fire. So the point unlocks in 15. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, so they're just kind of dancing around the front yard uh, seeing who's going to uh, get the uh, first initial cap and it's looking like uh, Jam Gaming going to be on this one from the start. Plenty of heels flowing around. Atar on his uh, almost world famous Genji gets uh, and a couple of nice frags. There it is. Points up for capture. Jam's on it, Bobby. Yeah, uh, Jam here with a capture and... Um... Actually, maybe they've forgotten the memo that it's a capture the point because they're all kind of abandoning it at the moment. <laughs> Yeah. And, uh, and they're just, oh my god. And uh, Atar there just hitting his uh, end, Genji Eddy there. And oh my god. Nothing's really uh, happening. I think they're just waiting for their team to respawn here. So as we uh, as we await another push from uh, Paragon to see if they can get the point back. And here they come in here. Oh. So they're in on the point. We've got a, uh, oh, I thought we were going to have. Uh, a couple of uh, big frags not going to be. It's still capping, so 34% in favour of Jam Gaming. They are bouncing around. It's interesting to note that you actually don't have to be uh, physically on the point to uh, keep it captured as long as it's yours. Oh, a couple of big gravity wells are getting dropped on opposite sides. And Ata again, three down with uh, the Genji. Doza still bouncing around, but he will be the last one who falls for Jam on the point. Some really nice gravity wells from both sides and uh, Paragon Esports are now starting to rack up the percentage. Yeah, that was a really great ult there by Bo Ray. Boy, Bo Ray, how are you we going to pronounce it? Oh, here we go with a Lucio ult there pushed in Jam Gaming. Let's see if uh, any Lucios can push people off the map. This is a fantastic map to play Lucio on. Let's see why there's a uh, Lucio there. And Atar, he's uh, on fire with his Genji. As uh, both uh, Zarya's throwing up their shields and beaming each other in the face here on the point. And it uh, looks like Jan's pushing back. And I think they're going to take the point here, Demand. Boy Ray's the only one left holding on. And they've just swarmed her and she's, she's gone down. And uh, Jan Gaming reta retakes the point there, Demand. They do. So 50% down. Interesting to note, both teams are opting for uh, Zara's at, uh, rather than uh, Rhymehearts on this. Uh, maybe that'll be something we see in terms of uh, like capture the points, the uh, difference in uh, tanks, the strength and weaknesses I guess of, of each, the abilities to uh, bounce around those shields, uh, to friendly targets as you uh, push through in on the site. But here comes Paragon Esports. Uh, it's going to be a lot of uh, long range goo slinging from uh, from both sides. As uh, Miracle, he's going to come through. Here it is. Oh, beautiful gravity. Well, on the front door. Stops him, peels, gets three, but uh, the counter wells down, and uh, well, pretty much that was uh, a whole lot of control with a whole lack of damage. Yeah, these Zarya's are really paying off. These are fantastic uh, selections of heroes, especially with the Lucio's and Zarya's. It's awesome to see. The Doze are still not a mercy though, and here we go, Jam Gaming taking the first uh, first point here. Here we go to round two. Uh, I believe this is a uh, checkpoint, um, checkpoint B, I believe. Checkpoint B? Yep. Awesome. Which is gonna see no one's. Uh, we've got a, oh, we've got a Symmetra here. Interesting. And a Widowmaker. 
So, two people changing up their character selection. So, Jim switched from the McCree to the Widowmaker. And yeah. we've got a. Oh, they've changed the Zarya. They've got one. Uh, one of the Zarya's has changed. Berserk has changed to Winston here. And they've still got the two Lucios oh, though. Oh, here comes the angry, angry ape. Oh, and it's fun. It's. I like the fact that it's monkey on Winston. I can't wait to see him just coming through and uh, banging his chest. So, uh, Cap unlocks in 10. So, just fighting for control of uh, the B side at the moment. Uh, Paragon and Jam. Currently 1-0 in favour of uh, Paragon. A couple of shields down for uh, Paragon. There it is. Points open. So it's under contesting. Who's uh, going to come through smacking down? The ape is going large as he's uh, just bouncing around and dropping the hammer. But uh, still yet to really kind of pick himself up. Frank's point still under contestion. Peels doing really nice work again. Uh, staying in front of his team. Oh, Ata! One, two, takes down the Winston. That is, and the, the healer as well. That is a big play from him. Yeah, that was, that was awesome. And um, as Jam gets the first capture of round number two, and as we wait for Paragon to respawn, here we go on the left-hand side of the map, and uh, sitting in that little room with the uh, with the pill, the uh, health, health pill. So as you can see, let's see what they do to recapture this. What do you think they need to do, Demand? Uh, I think they need to use their try and uh, get ult up on Winston. Here we Winston. go, here we go. They're already capturing it. Here we go. With, uh, with the Winston shield down there. Oh, Lucio ult by Flash. And then Jan's not giving this up that easy. And they're trying to take down that Winston. He's, he's getting his ult. He's slapping everyone around. And he's pushing in as many people as he can up the point. So they can uh, so Paragon can capture it. But he's the only one left there. He jumps out of the point. Berserk is going Berserk. And uh, he's... Oh, he's getting back on there. Zarya's there. Oh no, she drops, she drops. Zerk, the only one left alive on the point. And looks like, oh, here comes McCree. Here comes a Reaper. Here comes Lucio. And they are Lucio pops the ult. Looks like it's still contested here. It's still contested. Zarya's also going everywhere. The oh, Winston. It's, it's just chaotic in here, Demand. That, that Winston shield was so big, protecting them uh, as they got held in place. But uh, it's looking good for Jam to take this one 2-0. Over Paragon Esports, who are a bit of the uh, bit of the Twitch favourite again. Jimmy B on the Widowmaker is uh, picking himself up some frags. Jam locked into a corner, but there's no one there to capitalise with uh, some mass damage, and it is going to be. Looks like it's almost going to be a clean sheet here for Jam, Bobby. Yeah, well, one last roll, indeed. I think. Yeah. To be it. Oh, here we go. One last push there from Paragon. They still want to get a one last crack as uh, the monkeys are going head on with each other. Oh, Zerk just uh, jumps into the wall there, unfortunately. And then um, Zerk still goes berserk. He's going berserk again. He just pops his ult. He's jumping around. He still wants to. He doesn't let it up that easy in overtime. He's only the, he's the only member left. And he drops, and that's it. Jam Gaming. Clean sweep here. 2 0. Yeah, Congratulations berserk. to Jam. He popped, that's twice I was watching him, he's popped the ults, he's flailing around, but um, he's just air swinging for most of it. So uh, Jam versus Paragon, it's going to be uh, two zip in favour of Jam. And uh, who are we going to give the MVPs for? Is it this man who once again cleans up that, ATAR that Genji on the Genji? Ridiculous. He's... So Twitch, let us know, who do you think was MVP of that game, Jam B Paragon? Let us know. As we are 25 objective kills with 34 eliminations, ATAR, that's, that is some heavy lifting if you ask me. Oh, we hear some Dozer MVPs, some, some uh, Jimmy B MVPs. I think we gave it to ATAR last time, and Twitch wasn't happy, so maybe Dozer this time. Yeah, let's give it Between to Dozer. Between the two of them. So thanks for uh, watching round number three here. I'm Bobby J. This is D-Man. We're going to take a short break as we prepare to see the matchups for our next game in the winner's bracket of round number four. So stay tuned.